Hello everyone and welcome to a game of World of Warships. I'm in the the four American battleship, Wyoming. Ship has six double barreled 305mm guns, which is a lot of firepower. We skipped the start of the game because well then driving towards the action. I'm top tier and I'm platooned with a uh, Mayogi, a tier 4 Japanese battleship. Now these are the first shots I fired this game. They are not very impressive. Didn't get a good hit there. With a battleship who kind of wanna have your broadside pointing at the enemy. Of course, you can do a lot of damage with those guns. On the other hand, if you show them their broadside, they can do a lot of damage to you. Because it's easier to get citadel hits and to hit you, obviously, if you show them broadside. Now, we didn't get a good hit on that Wyom so far. We are bound to hit her eventually. Also, want to shoot armor piercing ammunition most of the time in a battleship unless you're shooting at a destroyer because it really does a lot more damage if you hit properly so far didn't get any really good hits but we'll see later on what uh, broadside of this ship can do. There goes the enemy battleship. Now we are trying to hit that Phoenix. This is a cruiser. It doesn't really much going for it. Oh, that volley, it looked really good, but there was only one hit, but that hit was a citadel. That did away frozen damage. Now, as you can see at the minimap, enemy is coming from the north. We don't have any ships up there. All our guys are going kinda. Yeah, which will be a problem. Also, I just got a very good hit, Citadel hit, and I got my first kill, which is nice. Now, at this point, I decided that uh, probably some someone has to defend the base, and uh, nobody else seems to be doing it. My teammate is uh, further ahead than me, he's kind of part of this, leading this charge, so not that much point in him turning around. Also, they are kind of pushing towards our carriers. This Langley is wisely away, I think. The Hosho, not so much. Now, this guy isn't spotted any longer, but I'm where he is, so I shoot anyway, and you see I've got one Citadel hit, which is nice. Now, the Hosho still hasn't really moved, and there are a lot of enemies coming. I'm pretty lucky that they aren't really doing much damage to me. Yeah. 
and here come the birds. Here you see a St. Louis. A St. Louis doesn't do much damage with its shots, but it fires a lot of them. And well, if she sets you on fire, then you just slowly burn to death. You can have more than one fire on you. So I just uh, close the fire and I started repairing the battleship. You have a repair skill, it has a cooldown. You see it only three times per battle. I'm trying to kill this St. Louis because, yeah, I don't like being on fire that much. And there goes the St. Louis. And we have our second kill. Now, the whole show, I think, has finally started moving, which is about five minutes too late. But, uh, yeah. I still think there uh, might be a chance of saving the Hosho if I get a good shot at the Phoenix. So now I can see... Oh, and you see I have three buyers on me right now and unfortunately I can't repair at the moment, which sucks. I decide to go for the Wyoming because she is much better target at the moment. A good hit there, no citadels, but I'm really lucky that the shooting HP ammunition at me. I mean, bias over time they do a lot of damage to you, but uh, good AP salvo just does so much more. Now I decided to go for the Phoenix, hoping to save the Opro. And that wasn't what I was hoping. Now I'm still under fire of uh, probably both. Phoenix is totally focused on the carrier. I'm dangerously low on health. That was another kill, a citadel hit, and I got confederate. Which is very nice. Now there are still two battleships. Uh, one Wyoming decided to go home and defend, because we have a really big push here. Oh, and it's looking really good for us. If we can kill that Wyoming here, it should be in decent shape. Now there is a uh, St. Louis coming together with the Wyoming, which really kind of sucks because I'm low at health. St. Louis has a lot, also the Wyoming has more health than me. I only have those carriers for backup and I mean if they get good torpedo hits then we could take those guys, but... It's a big if. And if we would fall here and I would capture him, it's still have kind of a chance, I mean, they're capping their base, they're halfway there, and there isn't much left of them to defend, so it still looks rather good. Now these shots are rather frustrating.
and the other fire start. Soon I can use my repair skill for the third and last time this game. Which might help. But I really need the good hits to make this build. Something like that. Now I got the high caliber award, two more citadel hits. And this St. Louis is soon going down. Now oh, I repaired the fire and I used my repair. I'm really low at health, so one good out of the Wyoming could just kill me. I'm desperately trying to finish the St. Louis off before she starts another fire on me. And another citadel hits and she goes down. So now it's me and the Wyoming. Now the bad news is he has like 25,000 health and I have 6,000 health. The good news is he is shooting HE ammunition at me because otherwise I would have died now. Still, I can't get rid of the fire at the moment. And I'm slowly burning to death. Now I got a very good hit on him. Also, there. Yeah. And unfortunately, those shots miss because now I'm just burning to death. But I've done alright. I have about 150,000 damage. And uh, I scored 10 Citadel hits. Got Confederate high caliber, 4 kills. But it doesn't look as good as it did before. Uh, our last ship capping just died. We only have uh, two carriers and the St. Louis left at this point. Yeah, this Wyoming is almost down. Maybe they can finish it off, but still. There also isn't much time left here. In the St. Louis is full. But, uh, at this point nothing really matters. They won't catch our carriers and we won't kill their ships. I mean the carrier alone is you know the, the time is isn't, a isn't enough time left to really care because they can defend. And so this is unfortunately a draw. Now, the reminder of that match isn't really that exciting to look at, so I think we can end it here. It was a nice game nevertheless, unfortunately not a win. And uh, it showed that uh, Wyoming is really a beast, especially if you are shooting AHP ammunition and your enemy doesn't, which gives you a big edge. And if you can score those Citadel hits, So I think I'll end this for my first video, uh, thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next time.